Hello, I'm Olumide McCauley. Here's your channel's television evening news recap for September the 15th, 2019. South Africa President Cyril Ramaphosa has sent out special envoys to deliver messages of solidarity to heads of state and governments across Africa following attacks on foreign nationals in the country. Former Minister in the Presidency, Mr. Jeff Radevi, Ambassador Kingsley Mbalo, and Dr. Kula Mbata will visit Nigeria, Niger, Ghana, Senegal, Tanzania, the Democratic Republic of Congo, and Zambia. 30 kidnapped victims have been released by their abductors in Katsina State. The 30 persons have been handed over to the state government, bringing the number of persons released so far to 45, as the ongoing peace deal between the government and the bandits enters its third week. Still on security matters, the Taraba state government has held a meeting with stakeholders to bring an end to the persistent clashes between the Tiv and Jukun people in the state. Briefing journalists shortly after the meeting, the state's deputy governor, Haruna Manu, disclosed that a committee will be set up on Monday, September the 16th, where 15 persons from both Tiv and Jukun will present their interests. On the international scene, Saudi Arabia has raced to restart operations at oil plants hit by drone attacks which slashed its production by half as Iran dismissed U.S. claims it was behind the assault. The country's energy infrastructure has been hit by the Houthis many times before, but this strike is of a different order, abruptly halting 5.7 million barrels per day production, or about 6% of the world's oil supply. And in sports, Callum Wilson scored twice as Bournemouth curbed early season optimism over Everton's prospects with a 3-1 win on Sunday. The England international took advantage of some sloppy defending from the visitors to head home the opener from close range, but Everton leveled before half-time through Dominic Calvert-Lewin. And that's the evening news recap. I'm Alumide McCauley. Don't forget to join us for fresh updates. Thank you for watching.